Easy peeps, welcome back to another episode of Started From The Bottom, The Road To Glory. How are we doing? Hope everybody is okay. Right, apologies for yesterday. There was supposed to actually be a video yesterday. I know I said I was doing sporadic videos, but yesterday wasn't going to be one of those days. Unfortunately, we got a little bit sick, right? Um, yeah, that, that's all I'm going to say about that. So Sunday was an absolute mess for me, which you'll see via some of the games we played, right? So... I was all over the place, right? So I, I'm basically just to give you a little bit of backstory. If you didn't know, if you're not over on Twitch, I'm allergic to gluten. Some so somehow gluten entered my body. We was like the exorcist for a good like eight to ten hours, and then afterwards it feels like you've got into the ring with Tyson Fury, Joshua, and everybody just pounding your ribs and back consistently for about fifteen hours. So we'd only played something like seven games or something of foot champs, and I was I was just praying and hoping that we could just get to like goal three right i was praying and hoping this it was an absolute mess right this weekend league was a mess we started off okay ish on the friday going four and two some silly losses i'm struggling with the gameplay anyway saturday we only played a couple and then that left us with um having to play uh some games well quite a, a few ish games on the sunday uh and then we wasn't feeling the greatest man we wasn't feeling the greatest we was playing some i was feeling a little bit oh what's going on here and then all of a sudden it happened and then we had to play whilst we was being oh man it was uh it was rough what we should have done is just not bothered right <laughs> what we should have done is not bothered um but you know it's 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 not too bad it's not too bad it's not the hardship you know it's not you know it's not like i've, I've been asked to paint the mona lisa or anything do you know what i mean we just got a little bit ill a lot ill uh and it affected it one of the losses that we took was this bad boy right here i don't even know we lost this game <laughs> i can't even even it's hurting now to laugh right uh i can't even tell you how we lost that game but we did we lost it and that was kind of the, the story of my weekend right i can't tell really tell you how we've won games i can't really tell you how i've lost games if you remember i said we changed formation up a little bit uh and if it was really good or it felt nice or it felt okay uh then i'll do a tactics video on it so this is the formation I i'm not feeling it right i'm not feeling this formation whatsoever we're only getting about four shots on target granted on my head's not in the game whatsoever right so the goals we're defending uh could easily be uh like you know stopped probably some of them right um and then attacking wise we're not as quick because my head my head's just not in the game um so Maybe that's got something to do with it. But even on the Friday when we was playing it, we just didn't have enough shots, right? We're, we're only getting... Whiz I think before we're averaging like 9 to like 15 shots a game, right? Now, all of a sudden, we're averaging like 4 to 5 shots a game. So either for us to score as many goals as what we've been scoring, we either have to literally score every single shot we take, which isn't going to happen on FIFA, uh, or we have to up the shots if we want to start scoring more goals. So this formation is not the one for us. Um, the, the goals... That the, sorry, the, the goals we score when we're in like tight games, um, we have to really fight for them, right? But because my head wasn't in it, we were just letting in sloppy goals like this one. Granted, the gameplay was heavy. Uh, granted, this patch is an absolute atrocious, f just mess whatsoever. But I'm going to take some blame on it because we wasn't, you know, our player switching or not necessarily the player registry of switching but i mean the choices we was making was way behind the curve anyway we, we was like lethargic we was we didn't really want to be playing it we was we was practically dead playing this weekend league right um that's that's no excuse that's no excuse but you will see by especially on the sunday you'll see when we go to the end of the month thing it, it's the end of the month the end of the week <laughs> i can't even speak man about the end of the week um weekend like tally you'll see what i mean but the reason we're showing this game is because it's another penalty shootout against a, uh, no disrespect, right? On normal circumstances, on, on playable gameplay with my head in it, a crappy player with an average team, we're, we're going to penalties. The last game, we lost. This game, we go to penalties. But the reason I'm showing this, and I'm not going to show all the games because I, you ain't missing much, let me tell you that. Um, 
And B, I just don't want to edit just, just rubbishness. But be rest assured, we lost a lot of games. <laughs> the reason I'm showing you this is because this is one we didn't lose. We actually won another penalty shootout. So Zoko banging it into the bottom right of the bottom right of the net. If he misses this, we win it. He absolutely scores it. So we need to score to win the penalty shootout. And as I said, spoiler alert, we did win this penalty shootout. I didn't really mean to put it where I put it. It was a little bit lucky. But like I said, man, I was in delay, right? My head was in delay. The game's on delay. And as you can see there from the Sunday of Magnificent Nuts, Nuts, Nuts. Look at that. We played four, what, our first four games on Sunday was all losses, right? So I was feeling that we went shopping on Saturday. I was feeling a little bit ill on the way back from shopping. Uh, and then I... Um, I, 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 I don't know what I had. I don't know what I had, right? So then Saturday evening we was playing and I wasn't feeling too great. And then that's when I was completely ill all over Saturday night. Uh, and then all through like Sunday morning. And then Sunday, I, I don't even know. We're stopping on goal three anyway, right? I, I couldn't play anymore. I had to go. I had to try and get some rest. We couldn't play anymore. We shouldn't have even gone to goal three, right? Uh, but those one, two was at four. Seven games on the Sunday were absolutely atrocious, man. I just, I, I, I'll be honest, I can't even remember them. But we, we wipe our mouths, we go again. Obviously, next weekend league is going to be Christmas, so we'll probably do a goal free then. And then we'll get back into it. But I might have a new formation. And we're going to test it this week on stream. If you want to watch it, come and watch us live on Twitch. Link is in the down below. Right then, let's see if we can get some goodness. So, gameplay's trash. Our results are trash. Weekend league was trash. Can we get something out of this hell of a mighty expensive SBC? Liquid, we spent around about 16,000 coins. This is working out between, what, 55-60k. So it's literally a gamble. This is a coin toss, right? You're just literally putting 60k's worth of stuff in to hope you get a 60k worth player back. That's basically the coin toss. I've saw people get unbop nay nays out of that, so then it's worth it. If you walk out of this with an 86 rated card, whoo! But that's the gamble, right? That's the gamble with FIFA. Is our luck in? These kind of things, we never get anything amazing. Can we actually get something fantastic? Please, don't be an 86. So we get a walkout. Of course, it's an 86 plus. It is going to be Spanish. It is going to be UCL. It is going to be centre-back. It is going to be the 89 UCL Ramos card. It's a dub. It could be a lot worse. But honestly, it's the same price as the SBC. So if we would have just gone and bought Ramos, we'd be exactly where we are. We're probably not going to use him. Um, but it's an all right one to have, right? For UCL, first owner, untradeable. Cost of the SBC. We haven't lost. We haven't gained. And again, our pack look on these kind of things just aren't it, my friends. But to see off the episode, we do have... I thought these pre-order packs finished weeks ago. They're still going. We've got our squad battles rewards. Obviously, squad battles. Everybody in the world's played squad battles this week because of the icon swaps. Uh, so you sh everybody should be getting them. There should be a more influx of cards onto the market because loads of people would have done squad battles that don't normally do squad battles. Uh, so go and have a look out for your bargains. I'm sure they'll like ride all the way through to like Wednesday probably. Um, so I we've got the squad battles, which is gold one, and then we've got our two rare gold pack pre-orders to see off the episode we'll catch up in tomorrow's episode uh with anything from freeze and stuff like that honestly though wednesdays are a little bit of a struggle we're struggling for content really uh wednesdays and fridays right um just because i mean i could fill it with content of like of, of you know this that and the other but it's got to be like soluble good content right so wednesdays and fridays we're struggling with judging by the views not a lot of people want to see foot champs gameplay any, anymore uh, and i've saw a few people in the same stage that are doing rtgs everybody's kind of struggling at the minute with uh what content you want to see on an rtg so if there is anything that you do want to see Drop it in the comments down below. Obviously, it's Christmas, so this is a bit of a lean time. When we go more into Team of the Year, it probably might pick up again. Uh, but if there's anything desperately that you do want to see, I have got a new formation that we're going to try out. So if that works, there will be a custom tactics video on that. But to see off the episode, we do have our two pre-order packs. First pre-order pack, we don't get anything amazing in terms of our walkout, but we do get a board. It is going to be German. It is going to be left mid, and it is going to be Sane. I, I believe... And that's the first time I've packed Sane this year. Not, not the card he once was, but still not bad for first owner objectives and stuff like that. So 85 rated Sane. And we do get a UCL Marcelo as well, which again, which is another nice one 
to get for first owners and i love that away czech republic kit as well absolutely beautiful and our last pre-order pack can we finish on a walkout we've been dry on these pre-order packs please ea we do we finish on a walkout is it going to be something that's going to be good we get french striker and let me tell you my heart went like ba-dum 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 for a bit let me tell you that let me tell you when i saw french striker walkout my heart went ba-dum ba-dum that just would have been absolutely amazing. It's what this account needs. We need some luck to G us up, to get us in love with FIFA. We need something. Unfortunately, we walk away with Griezmann. But could you imagine just if if that would have been? That would have been glorious. Right, so if you want to come and watch us over on Twitch, we are live. Link is in the description down below. Also, don't forget, if you need to see anything or you want to see anything on the RTG, let me know in the comments down below. For now, we are out of here, my friends, though. Thanks for chilling and thanks for watching. In a bit.